when I was at Arnhem, when we landed on the 17th of September, we went to a place, uh, the B Company, we watched the Capadas coming in, because that's our job, yeah. to defend the landing zone. That's right, and yeah. On the railway and bank where we, we lay, the Capadas were dropped over. Mm -hmm. And then we went along to Rinkham, just, just uh, B Company, mm -hmm. and we never met anybody until we got near, uh, I think it was Hilson, and a, an armoured car came up there, I don't know who was more surprised, them or us. <laughs> <laughs> we all fired them, they, they, they buggered, when they got killed, they buggered off. <laughs> and we got, we got into uh, this brickyard, and uh, that was in the afternoon, mm -hmm. a lovely day, we brewed up there, and they had clay, there's a big chimney still there, it's a monument, but a big chimney in there, and railway bogies, to put the clay, and my uh, maid, my platoon, Sergeant Watson, he said, you can dig in in front of them, but the bogus here, they were all at the back, you and Bull was digging there in the trench, so we took a trench there, we brewed up there, really lovely, you know, mm -hmm. and then during the night, we get there, the fucking blokes talk, and then the, I said to them, who the fuck are they, who the fuck are they, <laughs> and they say, yeah. I say they're in their fucking poles, they are. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, Sergeant Watson, we could hear them creaking over the fucking wire. Sergeant Watson fired the fucking very light. There's about fucking 10 or 12 fucking Germans in that fucking place. Yes. <laughs> and they, we, they fired them. One, one, get, one guy kept saying, wounded man, wounded man. Poor Sergeant Watson was wounded in the head. And he showed, if you're wounded, get back on the fucking road. And he kept <laughs> on and on and the fucking hell. Anyway, he got a sting and I was like, fucking see him off, you know. Mm -hmm. And he, he said, you come out of them trains, you get behind these bogies. So we did. And when it's stand to in the morning, you know, you're fucking waiting there. And that fucking bloke was about six foot from that fucking trench, that fucking oh, fucking yeah. chairman there. What, and he said, what, don't what go after him. Show him him, man. Mm -hmm. Don't go after him. That's mm -hmm. just a fucking ruse. You know, you go there and he fucking grab all day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But he see him off, yeah. And his, his wife, you know, his, no, his daughter, he was, he, she was born in October when he died in September. Mm -hmm. And she never had a photo of her father, couldn't get a photograph. And she said to me, you know, do you know anyone who's got a photo? Look for ever. And apparently, about well, nine months ago, somebody had found a photo of her father in civilian clothes. Mm -hmm. That's all over her house. And she's a Scotswoman, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I wonder how often that happens, because I always say it's like with Dave, you know, all these people, they say, no, we, we haven't got photos, we, you know, no, no. and then all of a sudden, one, one comes out of the blue from somewhere, you think, yeah, well, yeah. Who's, this is who you're talking about. I can't believe it. I mean, we've had it happen on, on our site, you think. Yeah. Where, where, they say, where did the hell did you get that from? Somebody just found it in my file somewhere or something like that. Yeah, it's made, you know? isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, that woman said to me, she, I mean, she, she said, my father said, those who fought the Arnhem didn't do nothing. <laughs> he never said the about him. I said, well, I said, well, my family always look around now, I keep, keep telling them, keep reminding them. Yeah, I'll make sure they know. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs>
all of a sudden there was a, the fucking boat stopped and all the mallows fucking dived over and they said, fucking hell, where are they going? <laughs> <laughs> they were going for the swim, weren't they? Oh, they took right. the fucking, they sort of scrambling that sand. <laughs> <laughs> to get them back and on. They sat down there and we're going along there and mind you, the war had finished with it, uh, Italy. I was on a caption reading a, a cowboy fucking book <laughs> and I happened to, I heard some the fucking bloke yapping away on the fucking tan over the fucking end of him and I, I looked over the side and I'm, from, from here to that wall a fucking submarine came up. Really? Oh, what a fucking sight. A fucking Italian submarine. <laughs> a fucking water, you know, I'm in a Kamal of fucking water. I'm fucking, what the fucking hell <laughs> is that? And the captain was talking to him. He was giving up. Oh, the submarine right. giving up. Yeah. And he said to him, I want you, and they and look at that in them, I want you to remain on the saves all the way to fucking Gibraltar. <laughs> Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What a fucking sight that is. Sure, I bet, yeah, uh, Then I see another sight which I always remember in, uh, in Bezerta, uh, a Red Cross uh, hospital. I was lit up, honestly. It was like a fucking black puma lamination. And the fucking, I don't know, but the fucking Germans, you torpedoed them bastards, didn't they? Mm. You couldn't mistake them, mate. Oh, what a sight. And we were in a fucking dark, we were in the fucking old boat, you know, no light at all.